Today we're gonna to check out three of the best coffee shops here in Monmouth County, New Jersey. Get a little recharge, let's go check them out. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. We just wrapped up a photo shoot for a property in Long Branch that we are gonna be listing next week. And it's about one o'clock in the afternoon. It's been a long day already. I'm ready for my recharge, my afternoon caffeine. So we're gonna head into the first of three of our favorite Monmouth County coffee shops, and that's Booster Dew here in Fairhaven. It's one of my local favorites. We're gonna cover three places today. Two that are my local favorites, and one that recommended was recommended by you guys on our Instagram page. So um, check it out, we're gonna head inside. Oh, right, um, before we go any further, see this little button down here? hit that subscribe button. Make sure you get alerted when we drop any new videos. Give us a like, and then of course, give us some comments down below. What did we do right? What do you hate about this video? What did we miss that should have been included? So let's go into Booster Do. What's up guys? Hello. Who's Lior? What's up? Is that you? Yeah. <laughs> I'm DJ. Okay. Uh, can I do a black and tan, please? So I'm making them large? I'll, I'll do a small, please. Milk? Nope, just black, please. I like really dark coffees, but I don't like them to the point where they're super bitter and burned. The After Dark is my personal wow. favorite. So welcome to Boots Cadu. Uh, this is one of my local haunts, is one of my local favorites. Um, they've got four shops. So James and Amelia Caverly that opened this um, brand, I guess you would call it. Started this in 2011, so it's really only about 10 years old. They were living in Manhattan at the time, decided that they wanted to get into roasting coffee and ended up finding that passion for doing it and opened up their first shop in Monmouth Beach. Now, 10 years later, I think they've got four cafes and they're in a whole bunch of other locations. They've got a kiosk in the Anderson Building in Red Bank. They've got another shop open in Bell Works if you're in that building. They're in Asbury Park. They're in the original Mama Beach location. We're here in their Fairhaven shop. And then they have a massive wholesale distribution as well, trying to get their product into as many people's hands as they possibly can. I fell in love with the taste of coffee just really out of necessity and then kind of followed my own path of what I like. I tend to like really strong flavors in everything in life, so I tend to like darker roasts. I drink my coffee black. I don't really like sugar in it, I don't like milk in it, so for me I love the, the, the actual essential taste that comes out of the coffee, but I'm a little bit of a purist, so for just a really well-made espresso or cup of coffee, this is, my, this is one of my favorite spots. So, so what I love about the Boosker Dew coffee is it's not, um, it's not bitter, right? So it's smooth, even though it's just black coffee. Usually you gotta add milk and sugar to it to kind of get that velvety um, texture out of it. But I love that it's a really smooth cup of coffee. Gets that little acidic pop in the beginning of it to wake you up, but it's not super bitter. Um, it's sour tasting, so it's just a really good mellow taste. This is the dark and tan, or black and tan, excuse me. The after dark's got a little bit more pop to it, so for me, that's why I love it. It's got that really, okay, you're drinking caffeine kind of taste to it when you drink it. So we're gonna head into now Rook Coffee, which is our second location we're gonna talk about. You guys are gonna recognize this spot because it's been in quite a few of our videos, so let's go check it out. So number two on our spots is Rook Coffee, which is probably the biggest name in Monmouth County coffee. They've now got, I think, 11 different locations throughout the county and you've got people with their stickers on the back of their cars. Um, and this is their Red Bank location. This is where you've probably seen us actually shoot videos of me walking out of here. This is my jam, either here or the one in Colts Neck. All right, we're here in Red Bank. Um, just got my coffee at Rook. Rook is another part of that Monmouth County Renaissance from like 2010, 2011. So this was started by Holly and Sean, who are childhood friends, both worked in corporate America and just decided during the downturn of the economy, they were gonna chase their passion. So they opened up Little Oak, which is their small Oakhurst shop in 2010, and then just crushed it. They grew a cult following for their coffee and they've just grown and grown and grown and now they're up to 11 different locations all throughout Monmouth County. And it's the same sort of feel as Booster Dew, right? It's a local Monmouth County original artisan coffee company. 
The beans are roasted at a warehouse here in Monmouth County, and then they are brought out to all the different locations. They're a little bit different in that they don't wholesale, right? So they're not having their coffee sent to restaurants in the area. If you want Rook's coffee, you have to go to a Rook shop and get that. Um, but one of the greatest things about their business is they've kind of captured what people love about coffee and the experience of drinking it, which is I'm gonna pull up, I'm gonna grab my cup of coffee, I'm gonna get out and I'm gonna go on with my day. So they're set up in a way, all their locations where they're high traffic, pull in, no tables on the inside, grab your coffee, get it and go. So a little bit different than the Boosker Do method of setting it up sort of like a cafe where you're gonna hang out and spend some time with your friends, but it's a focus on coffee. It's not super expensive, but it is really, really, really good. And what I am drinking today has a cult following, which is called New Orleans style. So New Orleans style is um, blended with like a chicory flavor to it. So it's really, really hard for me to explain, but I guarantee you this doesn't taste like any other coffee you've ever had in your life. And you either love it or you hate it. And the following of people who love this get it tattooed on their body. That's how good this stuff is if you love it. So that's what I'm enjoying today. It's got sort of this sweet herbal flavor to it like a very Christmassy flavor to the type of coffee. So this is my NOS, my New Orleans style. In the summer, I love their cold brew. I'm not a big fan of iced coffee. Um, so when it comes to iced coffee from Rook or from Booster Dew, I'll actually get it without ice in it because it's already cold brewed and I'll just drink it straight. Um, but New Orleans style in the winter, this is my jam for sure. So I'm gonna drink this, make a little walk around Red Bank. Definitely check out Rook if you're in Monmouth County. There's so many different spots, whether you're on the western reaches in Manalapan, or if you're down in Asbury Park, Manasquan, Red Bank, check out their spots. It's great coffee. Oh, and by the way, that's the Rook. Look it up, Google it, it's a type of bird. All right, guys, so this is the real world. We shot three locations. One of them chose not to be in the video after we shot it and edited it, so I can't show you any of it. So I'm sitting here in my home office, which you might recognize from social media, with a cup of Nespresso, and we're gonna do something a little bit different. So, as long as you are sub subscribed to our channel down here, if you correctly guess the name and the location of our third coffee shop, we're gonna take a random drawing of the people who get it correct within the first seven days of this video dropping, and one of you will get a $20 gift card to that location. It's the way it works. This is just sometimes the real world, not everything works according to plan.